everybody and welcome back. I brought you with me today because I'm on a road trip and I thought I'd use my time wisely and talk to you instead of looking at the back of a semi truck which seems to be uh, what I've been doing a lot of and I brought with me some products that I've recently purchased and hope that you enjoy hearing my reviews of them. I want to tell you about a product that I bought and really do love it and want to share it with you. It's the Shu Amura Art of Hair Ultimate Remedy and it is wonderful. It's for uh, damaged hair and it's infused with lotus and you are going to love it. You can order it from the Shu Umura website uh, that I'll put down below, but also I have seen it on Amazon, so I'll try to find that for you as well. But it's packaged like this. There's a close-up of it, and then it puts a pump. You pump it out, and it has a, just a small pump of it. Goes a long way. I'm not sure you can see it in the in the car, but it's very very emollient, and it will absorb into your hair. I use it after I have washed my hair, conditioned my hair, and before I dry it. I put just a few pumps on my hands and run it through my hair, and it is just a great product. And I hope that if you try it, uh, you love it just as much as I do. Now you're going to remember this product is a Park Avenue Princess, and it's the Tarte products that are used for contouring. It's a new contour palette. It's not as new now. Uh, this has been, if you'll remember, I bought this maybe a month ago, and I was fairly new at that time, and I'm, I'm not what, sure what the newest Tarte products are, but this is the neutral colors that are just wonderful. My favorite is um, the Princess Cut, and it matches my skin tone great. I have used the Crown and Angel both as bronzers, and what I have found is that with these brushes, this is the um, Velvet Luxe 3, 315 by IT. This is the one I use for contouring. Love this brush. And then for bronzing, I use this brush, which is the Sephora, and it's the number 92. It has a much wider brush, so it's perfect for bronzing. And this one has the more chiseled edge to it, and that's perfect for contouring. From that same shopping trip that we took to Ulta, I got the Earth Therapeutics Under Eye Patch. I'm loving these and I think you will too. It is the very smoothing. After you've used them, I left them on a little longer than they uh, suggested. They suggest 30 minutes and I think I left it on maybe 45 minutes and just love it. Very smoothing. In addition to that, I have picked up these uh, Hydrogel Lip Treatments. Love those too. You're going to like it. Now, this is a lipstick that I bought about two days ago. And it is the Maybelline Color Sensational. It is Nude Embrace number 650. It is a beautiful color, and I wanted to try a matte lipstick because I think I have gotten so used to wearing a glossy lipstick that I needed a change, and I'm glad that I did not spend a lot of money on the matte lipstick because I really don't think it's going to be for me. You're going to remember this one. This is Urban Decay. It's the eyeshadow named Scratch. And I really like it. The color is great. The, um, the only problem I have with it is a little too much sheen for me. But as I'm blending it, there's not a lot of fallout from this either. It's pretty good. Uh, well, as I'm blending it, the um, sheen seems to, to dissipate a little bit. But uh, I am still in search of the perfect color eyeshadow. 
another product I just bought. It is the Maybelline Tattoo Studio Waterproof Brow Gel, and I bought it in the medium brown color. That is what I purchased, and it is for uh, fuller, thicker brows, and it's supposed to not not supposed to transfer, but we will see. I haven't tried it yet, but I'll let you know as soon as I do. This is an item that I ordered only because of the name. I have been looking for it for some time and had been to several stores. Finally, I was in Nordstrom one day and asked about it. They did not have it because I imagine they just sell out as soon as they get it. And I ordered it and it came in and I love it. It is Bredo's Gypsy Water. And I know a lot of you already have it, but I wasn't familiar with the scent and I hated to um, purchase it without knowing if I was going to like it. But I ordered the roller of the Gypsy Water Oil and I think the scent is as great as the name. is an item that I've been looking for for quite a while on my never-ending style chase and that is the Celine Tildes. I got them in the opal brown which I think will go with just about any color and I think that I made a pretty good purchase. They come with uh, a, a flexible case. I prefer the hard case, but uh, I think we'll make this work unless I run across a nice Celine hard case somewhere. It also has a dust cloth with it, and I, I think I'm really going to enjoy these. Well, those are all the items I wanted to show you today, but I wanted to thank you for being with me on this little road trip. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to be a subscriber, please tap the subscribe button.